Hello everyone, welcome on my channel. Today we will talk about Ford and their operation. Okay, East and Southern Asia. Ford formed its first passenger vehicle joint venture in China 2001. Six years behind GM and more than a decade after VW, it has spent as over 2013 4.9 billion dollars to expand its lineup and double production capacity in China to 600,000 vehicles. This includes Ford's largest ever factory complex in the southwest city of Chongqing. Ford has 2.5% of the Chinese market in 2013, while VW controlled 14.5% and GM had 15.6% according to consultation LMC Automobile. GM outsells Ford in China by more than 6 to 1. Ford's presence in Asia has traditionally been much more confined to Malaysia, Singapore, Hong Kong, the Philippines and Taiwan, where Ford has had a joint venture with Lai Ho since the 1970s. Ford began assembly of cars in Thailand in 1960, but uh, withdrew from the country in 1976 and did not return until 1995, when it formed a joint venture with Mazda Khaled Auto Alliance. Now based in the Bovin Sub district of the Skiraj district in Chonburi, the factory still produced passenger automobiles. The factory built in 1941 in Singapore was soon taken over by the Japanese during the war and was the site of a surrounder of the British to the Japanese. At the factory site, which is now a national monument in Singapore, on April 30, 2013, Ford Motor Co. Ration launched their car and truck line in Myanmar. Previously, heavy important taxes had uh, stifled imported car purchasing in Myanmar, but due to currency reform, lifting of previous import uh, restrictions, and the abolishment of shadow currency, Myanmar's car market had grown in demand. Okay, next one operation is South Korea. In 1967, Ford partnered with the South Korean company Honda and at the new factory in Ulsan, South Korea, built uh, the European Ford Cortina until 1974, when Honda introduced their all-new Honda Pony in 1975. For their development, a relationship with Korean oldest car manufacturer Kia, uh, which built vehicles co-engineering with Mazda. Later selling the first uh, festival from 1988 to 1983 and the first Aspire from 1994 to 1997 for export to the United States with the acquisition of a stake in Japanese manufacturer Mazda in 1979. Ford began, began selling Mazda's Famila and Capella as the Ford Laser and uh, Telstar throughout the region, replacing the European sourced Escort and Cortilla. From 1989 to 1996, Kia imported the Mercury Sable from Ford in the US and sold them in the South Korea and the Kia Sable. Thought the Sable was branded and marketed as a Kia. It uh, retained the Mercury budget and emblem. Ford lost their Kia interest to Honda in 1998. During the Asian financial crisis, Kia had declared bankruptcy in 1997. In 1998, uh, Honda Motor Company acquired 51% of the company, outbeating Ford, which had owned an interest in Kia Motors since. So 1986. After subsequent divestments, Honda Motor Company owns less than 50% of the company but uh, remains Kia's largest stakeholder. 
As of 2020, Ford sales the Explorer, Mondeo and Mustang, as well as the Lincoln Aviator, Continental, Corsair, MKZ and uh, Outlist in South Korea. And uh, next one operation is South and West Asia. Ford India began production in 1998 and channels Tamil Nadu with its Ford Escort model, which was later replaced by the locally produced Ford Ecole in 2001. It has since added to the Fusion Fiesta Mondeo and Indivore models to its product line. On March 9, 2010, Ford launched its first made for India compact car, starting at 349,900, the FICO was Ford's first car designed and priced for the mass Indian market. On July 28, 2011, Ford India signed a memorandum of understanding with the state of uh, graduate for the construction of an assembly and engine plants is settlement and planned to invest approximately $1 billion on a 460-acre site. In 2019, the company and Mahindra formed a joint venture to develop, market and distribute for branded vehicles in India. In September 2021, Ford India announced plans to shut down both its assembly plants. The company said that it intends to maintain its part and service network. Ford's market presence in the Middle East has traditionally been small, partly due to previous Arab boycotts of companies dealing with Israel. Ford and Lincoln vehicles are currently marketed in 10 countries in the region – Saudi Arabia, Kuwait and the United Arab Emirates as the biggest market. Ford also established itself in Egypt in 1926 but faced an uphill battle during the 1915s due to the hostile nationalist business environment. Ford distributor in Saudi Arabia announced in February 2003 that it had sold 100,000 Ford and Lincoln vehicles in commencing sales in November 1986. All of the Ford and Lincoln vehicles sold in that country were Ford Crown victories. In 2004, Ford sold 30,000 units in the region, falling far short of General Motors, 88,852 units and Nissan Motors 75,000 units. Okay, next uh, one region is South America. In South America, Ford's primary operation are in Brazil, Argentina, and uh, Fort Andina. Uh, Ford employs over 18,000 people and operates seven assembly uh, of uh, or the of other plants in the region. In 1987, Ford Brazil and Ford Motor Argentina merged their operation with uh, the Brazilian and Argentina operation of Volkswagen Group, forming a new joint venture company called Auto Latina with a shared model range. Auto Latina was dissolved in 1995. In early 2021, Ford Brazil branch announced it would uh, end completely his uh, production in the country over the course of a few months. Next one operation uh, is Africa. Okay, let's start. In Africa, Ford's market presence has traditionally been strongest in South Africa and uh, neighboring countries with only trucks being sold elsewhere on the continent. Ford in South Africa began by importing kits from Canada to be assembled at its Port Elizabeth facility. Later, Ford sourced its model from the UK and Australia with local versions of the Ford Cortina, including the XR6 with a 3.06 engine. 
and a cortina based Becky or pickup, which was exported to the UK in the mid 1980s. Ford merged with the Rio company owned by Angio American to form the South African Motor Corporation. Following international condemnation of Upper State, Ford divested from South Africa in 1988 and sold its stake in Samcor, although it licensed the use of its brand name to the company. Semcor began to assemble Mazdas as well, which affected its product line, uh, line up and saw the American Ford like the Escort and Sierra replaced by the Mazda based Laser and uh, Telstar. Ford brought a 45% stake in Semcor following the demise of uh, Upper Z in 1994, and this later became once again a wholly owned. Subsidiary. The Ford Motor Company of uh, Southern Africa Ford now sells a local sedan version of the Fiesta, also bought in India and Mexico. And uh, the Focus, the Falcon model from Australia, was also sold in South Africa but also dropped in 2003 by the Mondeo after briefly being assembled locally was dropped in 2005. The Mondeo was latent a uh, introduced in 2015 budget as a fusion but was dropped in 2017 okay that's all uh, that's all about uh, operation of Ford thank you for watching please subscribe